need more wood for the fire. They needed most of the lumber to repair the guard towers. We'll have to make do with what we have. Well, if they need arrowheads for the battle, then I need more firewood. I've already cut plenty. Besides, I don't know how much more time you'll have left to forge. Hmm. We can make points faster than broadheads. That should be our focus. Not much fuel left in the torch. I think I can get four, maybe five more sheets cut for the barricades. And then we'll have to find more. That's gonna be a problem. I dragged the last of those cylinders out of the Soviet prison a few summers back. After that, you're back to using a hammer and chisel. There's gotta be more. The Soviets left everything. We spent two full days combing the old building. That's I promised to keep them safe. What have I done? We should have been ready for this. We knew better, damn it. to fall when the wind picks up? You there. We could use some help if that's what you're here for. Sorry, I've got no time to talk. Jacob says you can be trusted, and that's good enough for me. Just keep your eyes out. I could be here at any moment. I'll do what I can. I'll run out of nails before we're done here. We can pull more out of the old cabins. The ones we don't use anymore. Can't the smith forge more? I just need a few dozen. He's making arrows. I'm here to help. What can I do? We're trying to fortify as many of these towers as we can. Most of them were badly damaged in last year's floods. We've got the repairs in hand, but I need some extra supplies from around the valley. If we can get these towers repaired, it'll give us an advantage over the invaders, and it'll help us reach the upper levels of the ruined towers. Will you help? I'll see what I can round up. Thank you. Bring them back to me when you found them.
For a year, I have ridden with an army of Mongols, as envoy from the Order of Trinity. The Khan is a great warlord, despite his heathen ways. Under my influence, I have helped them topple nations, burn cities, and kill princes, all in search of the Prophet. Our slaughter of the Rus was not in vain, for among the spoils we at last found the map. And now, this very morning, after a season in the mountains, we saw buildings rising from a green valley surrounded by ice. We have found Kitesh. I tell the Khan of the riches that will be his, and that alone drives him on. But the real victory will be for God, when we purge the Prophet's lies from the earth, and at last the divine source will be ours. Not yet, but I will. So remote, yet so beautiful. Jacob is assembling fighters in the upper village to draw their attention there. The children and those too old to fight will be safely hidden in the Acropolis catacombs. I will go there once things are in hand here. You said they were heavily armed. How can we expect to beat them? The fight will not be won in open combat. They will hit us hard and fast, and we will take losses. They hope to crush us in their initial but we will turn their eagerness into our advantage. This will be a long engagement. If we hope to survive, we must wear them down slowly, strategically. We will bleed them from a hundred cuts until they have nothing left. Only then will we be victorious. Today, we win by survival. Lara, I could use your help. Our people are spread thin across the valley. If you light the signal tower, they'll know that the danger is imminent. I'll do what I can. Once the fire is lit, they'll know what to do. When you've completed your duties, rendezvous in the upper village. Understood? Yes! Understood! Good.
Thank you, Lara. Our people have been warned. That should give them time to evacuate. Meet me in the upper village. I'm gathering our forces here. All right. 